632 meters. That's the height of Shanghai Tower. Right now I'm standing exactly 632 meters away from the building and believe me, 30 years ago, this view was complete farmland. But after the addition of this building, Shanghai's skyline has changed forever. The men's record for the 2019 Shanghai Tower International Vertical Marathon is 17 minutes and 25 seconds. That's 119 floors in 3,398 steps, which works out at one floor in 8.8 seconds. Yeah, um, I think I might take a more direct route. How about an elevator that makes you Usain Bolt look like a snail? This speed machine can rocket up from B2 all the way to the 118th floor in just 55 seconds. We have arrived at 118th floor. I'm now standing at the highest observation deck ever conceived by humans, appropriately named Top of Shanghai. This is a 360 degree panoptic donut shaped deck which gives you a truly epic view of the entire city and beyond. Just, wow. While this is called the top of Shanghai, there's another place that's even higher, the 126th floor. It's the tower's highest level and it's open to the public. But what I'm interested in is its record setting damper. The total construction area of the Shanghai Tower is 578,000 square meters. That's just like making the first 1.5 kilometer row of buildings on the bun stand up on end, inception style. It's a vertical city. You've got the world's highest indoor Chinese garden, as well as China's highest museum and bookstore. And that's just to name a few. Hello. How are you, how are you? <laughs> When planning Lu Jiazui 30 years ago, a dream of building three mega skyscrapers was born. 30 years later, not only did this dream come true, it also became one of the most iconic symbols of Shanghai. But this multi-record breaking dream wasn't just about heights, it was the brainchild of many generations combined. This is Pudong. If you can dream it, you can achieve it.